Despite his best efforts, what we're seeing here is an example of how errors leak into manufacturing. Operator error. Metrology involves not just specs and tools, but also how things must be measured. So, measure the stud on the very top of his head. Okay, now this, also where you measure matters, that stud isn't perfectly straight up and down, so it's gonna matter whether I measure towards the bottom of it or the top. But if we're, let's just kind of do it that way. It looks like 4.8 millimeters. 4.8, so go to the bottom. Oops. 4.83. Well, are you sure you're using that thing correctly? There's not, I think so, but I'm sure there are no animals in there. Behold, the reason metrology and precise metrology equipment were created. When you've got handheld tools, the measurements you need can change depending on how you're holding the tool, how you're holding the part, and if you're using the measurement tool properly. When you're looking at dimensions so small, smaller than a millimeter, these changes can multiply and create much larger errors. So, best practices are, when you can, put it down and don't touch it. <laughs>